Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? So, we are looking for a new game to play, and I'm looking for a game to play once a week on a Thursday, uh, on a Friday rather, in place of Destiny 2, because quite frankly Destiny 2 has absolutely tanked and nobody is particularly interested. So, I've got two games here, I've got um, Oxygen Not Included and Stardew Valley, and a lot of people have been suggesting both of these games. I would also like to find something to start uh, playing a few more episodes a week. But first of all, we're just going to watch this trailer for Stardew Valley for those of you who don't know anything about it. It's a very basic kind of graphics and... I mean, I, I haven't actually played it yet, but I have watched a couple of short videos on it, and it does actually look like something that could be quite interesting. You've got very basic graphics, it's very simple to get into, but there is a lot of complex aspects to this that kind of make it a lot more interesting. Um, you've, got all, you've got various basic farming activities to do. Um, it is very reminiscent of likes of Farmville and things like that, but there is more to it. There is a lot, lot more to it as you start building up. You, you've got this aspect here, which you can see where we're doing the farming, we've got some animals and stuff, but there's a whole town that you interact with and there is places you go exploring, um, caves that you uncover various different things and you've got um, various other challenges as well. So here he's uh, mining in the cave, getting copper ore and so on. Um, fishing is quite a, a basic one, so it's, it is kind of like a simulator. Um, yeah, I, so I don't know. I mean, yes, here's one of the caves where you go exploring. There's things to fight. You've got a, um, you've got a battle, and um, yeah, I, I don't really know very much else about it, but I do know that a lot of people have suggested this game to me. Um, I've got, I think, another week or so of gameplay for Gold Rush, and then we, we've kind of exhausted what we can do in that, and it's literally just going to be rinse and repeat of digging and washing mats out, and I don't want to spend seven days a week doing that. So after maybe another week, we're going to be reducing the number of Gold Rush videos that we're doing, and I want to find something to replace Gold Rush. Now, I'm thinking at the moment that Star Stardew Valley may not be to everybody's tastes. So maybe this one here is something that we would do on a Friday, one day per week. Um, so you get one episode a week and we can s sort of start working our way through it. And I I'll play it by ear and we'll see what people like. So there's an idea of what Stardew Valley is like. I'll go and get the next one and we can take a look at that one as well. Right, now this is the... Auction not included, E3 teaser. It's only 20 seconds. Makers of Don't Starve, the graphics will be familiar for those of you who've played Don't Starve or uh, seen my little playthrough that I did of it. Uh, just uh, bring that down a little bit. There isn't, it doesn't really show you a lot there. Let's find another video, shall we? Right, this is a, this one might be slightly better. You may get a little bit more from this. We've got um, some different biomes and stuff. The, the basic premise of, um, Oxygen not included is that you start out life on an asteroid. You've no idea how you got there. You've got to mine the asteroid out and um, maintain all kinds of different machines as you go along in order to make sure that you've still got oxygen and food and everything else that your uh, little explorers might possibly need. It does look like it's a lot of fun. I like the, the graphic style of this. I really do like. And this game appeals to me a lot more than Don't Starve because you save progress. You don't have to keep restarting everything. And that's something that I particularly like. You've got all kinds of researches and um, different machines and stuff like that that you can make. Let's see if I can find another one for you a moment. Right, and here's the final one. This is on their website. I'm just going through their different introductory videos that they've given us. So some of them are a little bit repetitive. But this, this here, this gives you an idea right here of the kind of thing that you could expect from it. Just uh, jump back a bit there. You, your base starts off with just this little tiny base right here and you just expand and you expand out and you get all of these different machines and um, construct all this different stuff. Now, my thoughts at the moment are we will play Gold Rush for probably another week and then we're going to be running out of, a, um, we're going to be running out of content with the game. I don't want to just keep repeating the same content because it's just going to get really boring to watch. Nobody's going to be interested. Now they are um, rolling out updates for that game. So what I figured is three days a week we will do Gold Rush and three days a week we will do 
oxygen not included. I'm thinking that Stardew Valley is going to be less appealing to most of you who watch this channel than the other one. So I'll just carry this one on. Um, Stardew Valley be less appealing than this one. So, I mean, this this does look quite in interesting. Cody has been entombed. New duplicates are ready. Mercury frozen. He hematite melted. New element discovered. No power. So yeah, you so much stuff that you've got to sort of look after as you go through. I mean, look at the and the artwork as well. It does look really really entertaining. Um, so I think this could be quite good for three days a week. Now I hear you shouting. But that's not seven. You, you've been doing seven days a week. Yes, I did do seven days a week for Gold Rush, and I have been doing it. It's not going to continue. I did explain previously that it's very, very difficult for me to get three episodes done for a Monday. Monday is the most difficult day to do because I have Sundays off. Sunday is my one day off each week. I can't get any more time than that, but I do have a family, I have a wife, I have children. I want to spend time with them. So I'm not going to be spending my Sundays um recording as well as all of the rest of the week i need a little bit of downtime i want to spend some time with my family so mondays it will be two episodes you'll get um your farming simulator episode and i'm going to be doing banished on a monday as well it's fairly simple for me to get those two out so i will do those two and then you won't get a video at six o'clock when the gold rush videos have been going up you get one this week but this is the final week for three episodes on monday so there'll be two videos on a monday and then three videos each day for the rest of the week. I think that's how we're going to be sort of settling in. So yeah, which do you want? Do you want Oxygen Not Included three days a week? Or do you want Stardew Valley three days a week? Or would you prefer me to do something else entirely? I'm going to put a poll up for um, ONI and Stardew. And you can sort of... You, you can vote on that one, but I would also like suggestions down below for another game that we could play three days a week alongside Gold Rush. I'll still play Gold Rush, but it's reducing down to two, three days a week from probably next week. I'm going to do it this week, but then I, I really do think we're going to have run out of content by that point. So we're going to need to look for something else to play. Um, so this is my ideas. Let me know your thoughts, good and bad. I want to know all opinions on this. What do you think? Are you psyched about this are you looking forward to me playing oxygen not included do you think it's going to be interesting or would you prefer that i didn't play this game at all and i played something else entirely and also same with stardew valley are you interested in it do you want me to do it would you prefer me actually to do three days a week on stardew valley and not play this one quite so much just do this one day a week give me all of your thoughts and i will read everything that you say and i will process it and let you know what's going to happen uh probably well it'll be later in this week i'm asking you now because i want to know which game that we're going to be playing on friday so you'll find out on friday what's going to happen if you enjoyed this video please head down below and give me a like and if you really enjoyed it then please tell your friends all about me get them to come and watch as well that would be awesome but until next time thank you very much for watching this is frithgar goodbye and see you later